Hey guys, this is Swordfish. Today I'm playing Rogue Legacy. I've spent the last couple episodes doing stuff like collecting money and and uh, leveling up, collecting money, leveling up, collecting money, <laughs> leveling up, etc. Um, and I decided that it's about time. Reduce damage. Oh. That sounds excellent. Do I have enough for one more damage upgrade? I do. Awesome. So I've decided I've spent enough time um, leveling up, leveling up, leveling up, getting more gold, leveling up, getting more gold. And it's about time that I try and kill a boss. There seems to be five bosses in this game. If there's five uh, circles here. And I've only fought one of them so far. I fought the eye. The eye boss. And, um. Okay, well, this is a tough. Colorblind is a tough. Oh my god. I can't say that things look like missiles, but they're not. Not a good start. So, I fought the eyeball boss a couple times before, but just sort of. Um, he just kind of destroyed me, and I didn't really get yeah, have really have a fair chance of killing it. So, I know that I wasn't prepared either. So, my goal for this episode is to get a castle layout. I mean, I'm obviously gonna. He'll, you know, try to do well and get some more money and level up regardless, but my goal is to find a castle layout that's where the boss is easy to get to and kill him. Easy to get to because um, I can use that architect thing to lock the layout and then I can go back really quickly without having to, like... Whoa. Is there a chest or something? No, this is just... Oh, this is actually that hard. Um, so if the boss is near the entrance... Oh! Oh, jeez. That would have been cool to kill that guy. There seem to be mini-bosses. I've run into them a couple times. A couple times now. Um, where there was one that was a huge skeleton. And there was one that was a... Uh, I don't remember the other one. I know that there was a huge skeleton, and it scared the crap out of me. And that guy was a huge knight, and he wasn't so fun either. Okay, let's see if this level is a little better. This nearsightedness is, is kind of annoying. Oh, jeez. Not my best work. So, I just want... Whoa. I have my shield. I... One day, I'm gonna learn to use that stupid ability. The shield thing. It's not like this is even hard. I'm just taking damage unnecessarily. I don't know. That's, I, that's sort of disappointing. This is boring. Just a hallway. Okay. I'm gonna try to traverse them a little, the the, uh, the levels a little more quickly too, just to see. Oh, elf. Okay. So. 
if if you happen to remember a few episodes ago, maybe it was last episode, I don't remember. It's been a few days, it's been about a week since I recorded my last, my last episodes. Um, so I haven't played, it might take me a couple to get warmed up, I haven't played in like a week. Um, but I had a crazy crackpot theory about how to win that, um, that elf gambling game. And I just proved it wrong. It was something like the when the elf has the question marks in his name, that's when he's, um... That's the chest that, that corresponds with the correct chest. Something ridiculous like that. It really was dumb. It was really stupid. Okay. kind of scouting. I don't want to take a lot of damage, too. I'd rather not kill everything. I'd rather not kill everything. Okay, here we go. This is exactly what I was looking for. Awesome. So, we got to the boss room. And we're gonna... S this was pretty quick. It was only a couple, and they weren't so dangerous. So we're gonna save this layout until we beat this boss. So here's attempt number one. Now, I, I know being a big guy, a big, this could be, I specifically remember that being able to just stand here and hit him. Oh my God. Wow. <laughs> So much gold! Diamonds and a huge chest! That was really funny, so I... I... <laughs> Alright, let's see what's in here. It looks like a, a, a rupee, a chicken, and a heart. Mana, weight load, and hit points. Oh, stat boosts, that's cool. And teleport... Ah, and lit up the eye. Wonderful. Well, that was hilarious. So, I s <laughs> I did a lot better than I expected. I, s I put- I dedicated this whole intro to being like, Alright, we're gonna go over and over and over again until we kill the boss. <laughs> I killed it on the first try. <laughs> I don't know why that was so hilarious to me. It was really funny. Okay. Well. The gigantism was definitely the key there. Let's unlock the lich, just because I like unlocking more stuff. Raise your liches into lich kings and grant yourself the power of both mind and matter. With a single press, convert your permanent health into permanent mana. I'm not sure why that's useful. Death defy. Release your inner cat and avoid death sometimes. That sounds useful. Is there anything at really cheap skills I can afford? Probably not. Probably not. What's down here, too? Minor. Speedlunker. That may be good. Gold up. Oh, yeah. Okay. We got stuff to buy. It's kind of funny that they named a guy Speedlunker. I mean, I realize that Speedlunking, speedlunking is a word, but... I've heard a lot of comparisons between this game and Speedlunky, which I haven't played, and I would really like to, because... I've had more than one person say, oh, you like Rogue Legacy? You should play Spelunky. You'd probably like that, too. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. They, um, I actually, I think, if I remember correctly, they just released an, like, enhanced edition on Steam. So, maybe I'll check that out. That could be fun. Maybe I'll do a video of that, too. Okay, so, our next goal, then... Since we beat the boss like imme immediately, like some kind of crazy, awesome gamers. Um, my next goal, I think, needs to be... Well, the next boss, there's five of them. Oh, that was horrible. There are five of them, so... I guess next we'll see what the next boss has. I, you know, 
which one should we do? That's, that is really the question. There are a few. There's four, three, three different, like, areas. There's the, uh... There's the woods area to the right, which always reminded me of that... No, I can't remember what it's called. In, in, uh, Zelda Ocarina of Time. Okay, this is gonna be a weird... Just, just go with me. Just, uh, hang with me for a minute. In Ocarina of Time, there's the well, Kokiri Forest. You start in the Kokiri Forest, if I remember correctly, um, as, like, Young Link. And then... Excuse me. Um, Zelda's gonna be all choked up. Um... You start in the Kokiri Forest, and then you grow up, and you go back there, and it's, like, all destroyed? Or no. You go back there... Alright, I guess we're going here. You go back to the forest, and there's one of the temples there, and there's, like, scary... Uh, wolf things? This is, this is a totally unnecessary metaphor. There's, like, scary wolf dudes there. Um... Anyway, the... Oh, I, I didn't realize my health was so low. Okay, I need to start... I need to focus a little. So, there's scary wolf dudes. And, um... That... That's, um... I have no idea what I was talking about. What was I talking about? Oh, right, the wolf... The, uh, the forest level at the... To the right of the castle reminds me of that. That's all I was trying to say. That reminds me of that. I don't remember... Oh, I guess I've had all this new stuff and I haven't really looked at it. Returns damage taken. That's kind of like thorns. That's cool. But I think this vampire thing is better. Oh, they were just begging for me to look at their stuff. I don't want to lock the castle. So, now the question is, should we go up, down, or right? I think I want to go... Yeah, there's up, down, and right are the three, and then this boss after we kill those. Castle, dungeon, tower, forest. I think... I think I want to do forest. I'm not sure why. It was the um, the first, like, when I was playing this right at the beginning. The forest was the, like, first level that I found, so I feel kind of, like, excited about going back to the forest for a good reason. Maybe that's why. But, uh, I think I want to do the forest. So I'm just gonna... Forest is to the right. So... Oh, boy. Oh, well, I need to... Just because I'm going right doesn't mean I can... What the hell? This is like a mini-boss. They're both like one hit away. Oh! I was so close. That was really close. Okay, so I need to be... Even if I'm a... Uh, still need to be more careful. Even even if I'm trying to go in that direction, I really do need to be a... I need to get there without dying. Okay. What's up? Well, that's the opposite of what I wanted. Oh, and I guess I'm a farty hero this time. You know what would be really funny if there were... So I know a few episodes ago, I was talking about 
how I wish the uh, character attributes had something to do with the game, other than just being like, aha, fart jokes. Whoa. Well, that's crazy. I'm glad I was paying attention. I'm surprised I was paying attention. So I was saying how I wish the, um, the character attributes were something into the game other than just a fart joke. And I started to game design exercise where you try to make sense of them. You try to make them do something useful. And I, I would take no damage, fairy chest. But we gotta focus. Watch the pattern. Alright, I can do this. No, I can't. No, I can't. Oh, and now I'm hurt, too. Oh, that would have been... You know what? That wasn't hard, either. Oh, well. Oh, well. So, anyway. I was saying how I... That I wanted to, um... Figure out how to make them useful in my mind. This is definitely the hardest. It, I, I, wow, okay, so we definitely shouldn't go down. We should not go down. This is way too hard. This is way too hard. This is way... Oh, holy crap. That was nuts. That was nuts. So we should not go down, for sure. Wow. And uh, I was definitely not allowed to, bound and determined not to finish that story. All I was trying to say, I was trying to get to how to make farts not a fart joke. And my example was maybe if one of the enemies has a huge nose and is really sensitive to smell, if you fart on him, he dies? It's still a fart joke. It still should be a fart joke, because, I, I mean, the whole purpose of it is a fart joke. It doesn't serve any practical gameplay purpose. Um, but it could also do something useful. The stereo blind one. Will you pray for assistance? Sure. Item found. Charon's Obel. What does that do? Have I gotten that before? Is that why it's not explaining it to me? I guess. Oh, that was... Oh, my God. What am I doing? I... What am I doing? What am I doing? That was really embarrassing. Everyone, I'm sorry you had to see that. I'm gonna try to kill this eye boss again. I don't have enough hit point. Oh, I can't? I guess he's dead now. I can't fight him anymore. Because that would be an easy way to farm gold, actually. So, it's kind of nice to see that they took that out, because that would be kind of cheap. Alright, I think this is where I want to be. These enemies are harder, but they're not impossible. Yeah, I can kill them, at least. kill these enemies, unlike that other place, those enemies were impossible. Let me just look at this map. This was, well, that place where I jumped and died and jumped and died and jumped and died wasn't so easy. So, my next goal, so now that I, um, oh, here's these stupid, this stupid thing. Right, maybe I'll just kill it like that. It's not the most exciting way to kill an enemy in the world, but it's safe. Or not. Or not safe. There we go. So I guess my next goal has to be find a world where it's easy to get to this, um, this woods thing. This wasn't bad, it was just a straight walk. 
except for that crazy um, jump, 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 jumpy thing that I failed at so terribly. I don't really want to try that again. I'm so actually, well, I'm still pretty low points here. A chest with a huge monster. Nope. Nope. Um, that was bad. Well, I want to see what's up there, and I also want to try to figure out, try to kill that wolf. Because that seems like it'd be impressive. Or just run past him. I'm actually... That's not... I don't find that shameful at all, except that I'm going to die here. Yup. Yup. Okay. Okay. We have some money. There was something I wanted to buy. Was it the more gold thing? Gold gain? 10% gold gain would give us an extra one gold. That's not really a big deal. But I guess it'll accumulate over time. What's over here? This is death defy. 1% chance of not... I guess, so, current 0%, upgrade 1%? That sounds to me like... I have a 1% chance of not, of surviving if I die, like it'll revive me. That's not super exciting. Um, I'm actually not really th thrilled about these upgrades, which is probably why I should do the ones that unlock new stuff. Which is this one, but I can't afford that. And this one? Yeah, I just want to see what else I can do. Spell Thief. That sounds exciting. Crit damage, crit chance. Crit chance. Let's do crit chance. I got a lot of hit points. I got this good psyche thing. Oh, oh, uh oh. Well, that's useful. Had I known that what that did, I wouldn't have spent all that money for no reason, and I would have saved up for something good. That's kind of annoying. It didn't tell me what that did. I, I mean, I guess I saw it earlier and was supposed to remember, but I have no memory of getting that thing at all. Glitch! Glitchy glitch! Okay. Oh boy. Let's ignore that room. <laughs> I, I'd rather not take a chance. I'd rather not take a chance. Back up to full. Up, so that's we want to go right. That's the only way to do that. And now I get to pray. What do we get this time? Hermes boots. What do they do? Is that am I jumping higher? That's what it seems like. I really wish they ex they liked explaining things in this game. That would be so nice of them. I guess I'm jumping higher? I don't know, it feels like maybe I'm jumping higher, but I can't really tell. So what does it do? Alright, Forest Ab... No, oh, okay. <laughs> I guess we're not gonna know. Yep, 
Yeah, this is definitely manageable. The dungeon, not so manageable. But I can kill these guys. I can kill these guys. This room is tough. I'm gonna avoid that for now. Well, this room is tough too. Oh, wow. Ooh. That dash has been really good to me. Now that I remember to use it. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, what am I doing? Why am I just running? I'm not killing, I'm just, I just panicked. That was, you just witnessed full panic just there. And here's the boss. Okay, well. This one was not hard to get to. Just kind of a straight line. Uh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. Of course I have to parkour around this one. It's not just stand still this way, you're sorry. The Forgotten Alexander. Oh boy. He has a lot of health. Well, his attacks are easy to dodge. This is totally doable. <laughs> I say as I suicide. That's totally doable. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna try to do it this episode. I'm not sure how much time I have left. I forgot to set my timer. Let me unlock another class. Just because I like having classes. Spell thief. That drains mana. Well, I guess that could be good. I mean, that is good if you have good spells. Oh my god, I only have 64 hit points. Well, I forgot to lock it. Yes, lock the castle. It doesn't save the map when you lock it, does it? It does, and there's a teleporter. Oh, this is perfect. Well, am I gonna kill him on this try? Certainly. But, I get to, uh, No, those are powerful. Okay. Okay. In options, you can enable quick drop to down strike and drop with. I'm not sure what that means. We want a lot of hit points. There we go. Alright, we're doing it. We're killing this boss. Lock the castle. teleport I love this I didn't you know the locking the castle thing well I guess I just never tried to fight a boss I haven't really tried to fight a boss yet he seems like easy enough just to kite him Sets, he lets a bunch of dudes out. I mean... Well... Oh my. Ah! Alright, there's a lot of these guys. That seems to be my problem right now. No! 
Okay. 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 Okay, well. That's a... Could have been better. Could have been better. We're gonna tr What is that? Freezing all enemies. That sounds really useful. Also, Lich King. Time stop? Okay, th this seems like the dude. Start weak, but gain life for each kill. That seems like what exactly what I want. And I can, um... I can maybe farm... Hit points from the... The early guys before I go... Before I go after the later... The, um, the boss. Maybe. I'm gonna try that, but I don't wanna take too much damage. This seems awesome, though. No! Well... Maybe on a, a level that had more enemies to kill. Max hit point. This is really cool. But I just... I keep taking damage. That's really bad. This isn't gonna work. This is a great plan that's totally not gonna work if I keep doing stuff like that. But I'm glad that I uploaded- I upgraded to this guy, because he seems exactly- like exactly what I need. If I can keep myself alive long enough to take advantage of it. And there's also the, uh... Vampirism. Oh no! I also have a vampirism, so I can maybe feed off of the, um, the guys that the boss summons, too. Maybe. I don't know. I'm, I'm taking so much damage, I don't think this is really gonna be... I really don't think this is gonna be good. Let's see. We're gonna go in and see if my, um, special also kills, or, like, attacks all the enemies on the screen. That could be good. The Forgotten Alexander. jump right into his attack. Well, that didn't go so well. Alright. That's gonna be my last, uh, last run of this episode. I was way more successful than I expected. I killed the eyeball boss on my first try. Without really any effort, I just kind of stood still and swung my sword. So, uh... Next episode, it seems like we're going to be able to kill that, um, the skeleton, the, or the skull boss, pretty, we're, it's possible, it's going to be tricky, and it's going to require a little more finesse on my part, but I think it's possible, so next episode, we're going to go for that, keep locking the world, keep jumping back there, so, uh, as always, guys, thanks for watching, uh, if you enjoy this game, and it looks like something you'd want to play, Please go support it. Support Celador Games. Indie games are awesome. And we want more of them. Uh, I'll put the website in the description as always. If you like this video and want to see more of my videos, please like it so that uh, more people will find it and also subscribe so that you can get more of them. I'm releasing videos pretty often. I'm very proud of myself for keeping on a schedule. So, uh, 
Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video. See if we can kill another boss. Bye for now.